Hey guys, so what is an exception? Well, it's a shorthand for an exceptional event, and basically it's an event that disrupts the normal flow of the execution of a program. So when this occurs, the method creates an exception object and hands it off to the runtime system. This is known as throwing an exception. So how are these exception objects handled? So when the exception object is thrown, the runtime system has to take this and find something to handle it. And this is known as the handler. So it looks in the call stack, which we'll be looking very shortly, for such a handler. And this handler is declared by a catch keyword. OK, so let's say you're running a program, and you start at main, and you call the method A, and then you call the method B, and then from that you call the method C, and then all of a sudden you have this error that occurs here. So an exception object is created and thrown. So first of all, it's going to look in method C for something to handle it with. And if it can't find that, it'll go up to method B. And then if it can't find anything here, it'll go up to A. And then finally, main. So this is known as a call stack order. And you could picture it like this. So first you call main and then you call method A. So you have main and then method A. And then you have method B and then method C. So once something occurs in method C, then you look for the handler in here and then you go back, pop this off first and then go back and then you look for it here and then pop this off and then go back and look for it in A and then pop that off and then look for it in main. 